That's right, guys, and all of that happened right here. You can take a look. Michael Vance was shot and killed on this road right here in Butler after getting in a shootout with law enforcement. Now, according to authorities, this all started around 10 p.m. when Dewey County Sheriff's Office pulled over a vehicle that was dragging a chain on the road. That's when Vance got out of the car and shot the sheriff twice, once in the arm and once in the shoulder. Vance then fled on foot and was eventually killed here in Butler. Now, authorities were able to locate Vance earlier in the day. After he turned on his cell phone, they pinged his location to a woman's house in Shattuck. I didn't know what to think when they pulled me out and when they went rushing by me with guns. Literally went in through everything. I mean, they come in here with shotguns pulled. Self, the cell phone was pinged to the woman's daughter's cell phone. They say they are unclear on how that cell phone is linked to Vance. Now, the manhunt, it all started in Hammond earlier in the day when a farmer found a makeshift camp on his property. He spotted the vehicle matching the description Vance was said to be driving, and he called police. Now, we've got a whole lot of details still coming in. We're going to continue to gather all that information, and we will continue to pass that along to you. Reporting live from Butler Road, Russell Jones, KOCO 5 News. Yeah.